Hey, welcome to this video. If you arrived here, you're probably starting for a view of Conduent. So we'll go over how it works. I'm going to give you my two cents with it. I think it's a good use of your time. I'm always coming out with videos like this, so consider subscribing. And if you'd like my free training on the number one simplest and fastest way to earn a full-time income from home, uh, you can click the link below. You'll see my email opt-in page. Enter your best email. I could send you my free training if you want. Uh, Conduent, let's dive in. So what it is, basically, it's a company that allows big corporations to outsource a lot of their work, everything from customer service, data entry, to sales, business development, IT, and um, they work with all different types of corporations, automotive, finance, healthcare, uh, technology, and on and on. And on the flip side of that, Conduit also allows ordinary people like you and me to um, to find jobs on here. Um, some are full-time, some are part-time, some are contract, um, some are um, uh, many of them are remote, remote jobs, so you can work from home. Uh, some are, some are on location. It just depends. Um, if you're interested in finding work, what you can do is just go to careers, and um, and you can filter by, uh, you know, category. Hopefully, this doesn't take too long to load. Uh, you know, category, uh, employment type, region, all that good stuff. So I'll just type in. Um, I'll go over three uh, entry level jobs you can get started with. So the first is. Uh, uh, remote data entry associate. Okay. Um, so this one specifically, um, it, uh, it says you need to live in Utah. Um, so let me just open this. I don't know why my internet's slow, but there it is. So. Uh, for this one is Utah. Some, sometimes you'll see ones that are uh, national all over the U.S., but this one's Utah specifically. Um, and um, and it starts at $13 an hour. Um, to get an idea of the full pay, what you can do is go to Glassdoor because they don't always tell you what you'll be getting in the end. Uh, Glassdoor and just sign up for an account and type in, you know, conduit. Uh, and the job and the job type, and you get an idea. And for this particular job, it was it was around thirty-two thousand, from what I remember. And um, and uh, and it also and Glassdoor is great for finding out if they have benefits, you know, what kind of benefits they offer, whether it's dental, medical, things of that nature. And if a, and if um, and if a specific job role isn't listed on here, you can just type in a general job. Like what do general um, data entry people make to give remote data entry people make? And that'll give you an idea. But this one, I remember it was listed for Conduit and it was around $32,000. So, and you can look at the requirements, uh, 40 words per minute. If you can't type 40 words per minute, you can come to, well, come to typing test and test yourself first of all. And they can also train you to improve your typing speed. Um, you know, typing speed is one of those things. It just takes practice. I started at like 20 words per minute. I used to be the slowest in my class, and now I can type, you know, respectable 65 or so. Um, after, it only took me a couple months to learn. So it's definitely something trainable, and you can just come here, uh, typing test, or just buy a course that'll teach you how to type. That's what I did. Uh, back to Conduit. So, um, so what else? Uh, so yeah, you know, GED or high school. Um, so this is a job anyone can anyone could get potentially. So that's uh, remote data entry associate. Is there anything else I'm missing here? Um, obviously, if you have experience, that helps, but it's not required. Uh, so Monday to Friday, it's your standard nine to five. Uh, it should be available on Saturdays as well, once a month. And then you'll have to do a background check uh, for these jobs. And the second uh, job I found was. Uh, Claims adjuster. Maybe, uh, maybe I won't bother typing it in because we'll be here all day. So, claims adjust. If I were to type in claims adjuster, um, that that one pays uh, fifteen dollars an hour, so not much more. But it was available uh, nationwide. And a claims adjuster basically, um, it, it, you know, it involves lots of problem solving. It involves research. So I'm surprised that it only paid $15 an hour, but I, but it, because it's remote, maybe that's why. So uh, just type in claims adjuster. Maybe I'll just pull it up. And then, um, yeah, so it's slow. Hmm. 
that's strange anyway um because yeah this morning it was there was a remote claims adjuster role so maybe it's just a little slow uh the third one was um just customer service sometimes it says customer ser uh, care rep customer uh, service uh it's all the same thing customer service rep So this one pays $18 an hour, but um, most of them don't pay that high. Most of them pay around $15, $16 an hour. The reason this one pays $18 is because I believe it's only available in three cities from what I remember. So yeah, it's available in, so it's not available nationwide. So yeah. Anyway, um, and as a customer care rep, you would just be taking inbound and outbound, outbound calls um non-stop um, if you've ever worked at a call center before that's exactly what this is you're just able to do it from the comfort of your own home so you must reside in new jersey new york or pennsylvania 18 dollars an hour but most of them pay more like 16. Um, a lot of these jobs they they'll have some sort of training usually lasts four to six weeks um and uh yeah so so the only thing with being a call center worker, although the pay is a bit better than being, you know, a, t a general typist, um, it's quite a stressful job. It's not for everyone. I worked at a call center for uh, four years, actually. Well, I, the first two years I did, uh, I was, uh, I did a data entry. And in the last four years I did, I was on the phones, basically helping customers with their problems. And it's, it's very draining. I mean, you're you're dealing with irate customers all day, nonstop calls back to back, so you can imagine. Um, and and so after about four years, I'm like, I have to get out of this. And, and so fortunately, I was able to find something uh, more fulfilling. Uh, so what's my personal opinion of Conduit? Do I recommend it? I would say if you need the money, like right now, it's a good option. I mean, these are real jobs. They pay, you know, full-time, basically full-time incomes. I mean, you could survive on this, this, these types of wages, depending on where you live. Um, you know, it's nice that you get to work from the comfort of your own home. You're not commuting two hours a day like I was. Um, but understand at the end of the day, there's still jobs. You're still working for the man. You still have that ongoing pressure. You have to hit their metrics. Um, you'll, you'll experience tech issues. Um, I'm also worried about the support if you can, I don't know, I, I'm assuming you have a supervisor for a lot of these jobs, but will they be that supportive? It's not like you can just go up to someone in the office and ask them a question. So, um, and you're just trading time for money at the end of the day. So, but as long as you're okay with that, um, you know, earning, you know, 30,000, the low 30,000s per year, you can go ahead and check out Conduent. Um, but yeah, so I would say in the short term, it's a good option. But for the long term, I, I don't I, I don't think it's for everyone. Uh, but look, maybe you're here not necessarily because you want to be doing, you know, data entry or call center work or, you know, claims adjusting. Maybe you're just looking for a simple, reliable way to earn money from the comfort of your own home. If that's the case, I was in a position three years ago. I tried all sorts of stuff to get out of my call center job. I tried blogging, freelancing, domain flipping survey websites, you name it, I basically tried it all. And none of the strategies I was implementing seemed to be working for me. It's just a very confusing and frustrating time. After two years of spinning my wheels, not getting any results, I was very fortunate or maybe just stubborn enough that I eventually stumbled across some incredible information that taught me how to find a digital product someone else created, find a group of people who'd be interested in that product. And when I connect the two together, I earn a commission. It's called affiliate marketing. And the great thing about affiliate marketing is the profit margins are incredibly high, uh, between 40 and uh, 80%. You could be a solopreneur, just one person on your laptop, uh, earning really good money. Uh, and there's tons of leverage and automation in place, meaning you don't have to be there all the time necessarily. Uh, and it's a very simple beginner-friendly business model. Uh, you don't need any skills or credentials to get started. Now, if you'd like to learn how to build out your own very profitable affiliate marketing business, all you have to do is click the link below. You'll see my email opt-in page. Enter your best email. I could send you my free training if you want. And that's basically it. I don't think I'm making sure I didn't miss anything here. Um, so yeah, you just click apply, apply. And you only have to apply once. You don't have to keep applying to each individual job. Um, so is that it? Yeah, just click apply. It'll take you through the process. They want your name, phone number, email address. You'll need to upload a resume. Um, but again, you only have to do it once. It's similar to other job boards like Indeed or uh, Glassdoor. 
Uh, for some companies, I, I should I should have mentioned this, I forgot, you can also submit your resume for general consideration rather than a specific job. Um, you'll see a, a connect with us option um, on their on their uh, page and you could submit uh, and you could submit your resume on their career site, uh, you know, typically on the welcome page. So I thought I should mention that. And that's it. Anyway, so I hope you enjoyed this review. I hope to see you on the other side of that link and I hope you have a great day. Bye.